all of our quest for truth and all of our quest for seeing the things that have gone and, and are still going wrong should be an inspiration to us to create a vision and a future that is beautiful and nourishing and clean and happy and healthy because our granddaughters and our great grandsons and the children to come they're going to thank us and they're going to love living in a place like that and we are the generation who get to create this who get to do this together who get to be the creators of the future for life after the matrix it's time isn't it it's really time can you imagine this future i've seen it many times in my dreams in my visions on my walks during our conversations scripted it sang about it it's a beautiful future and we truly we truly get to create it now even if it doesn't feel like it and even if we sometimes feel like it's not showing yet but we create we create it in our minds and in our hearts first and then it begins to manifest it begins to show up in every little flower you plant and every little every little tree you touch and every little thought of appreciation you send out to the beautiful birds that sing the morning song and every prayer of thanks you send out to the creator all of this creates the new future and we all have this power and this is so important to know and remember that we were all given that and we were all given this purpose and that we can do this we can truly do this a future that is pure again that is worthy of creating for our children and worthy of us living in and we get to do that if you feel today that for some reason there is little hope or no hope then know that there's even so much more than just hope there's millions and millions of people across the planet who have already put their energy into a new future who are already committed to creating this who are already in this and and if you feel that spark within you then join just join those people just by beginning to live in in more harmonious ways again first within you in your mind in your heart in meditation but do go out speak with your friends your neighbors your family find common ground you'll see how there's a spark within all of us that pretty much wants the same and the wisdom keepers they're real they're out there they're everywhere now they're coming out and they're speaking and they're not cult figures and they're not celebrities to be worshiped and they don't want to be worshiped and they don't want to be gurus or put on a pedestal that's not their their goal they just want to remind people of who they really are and remind us of our true power and they're coming out they're coming about everywhere they're coming in all ages and all sizes and all you know and men and women and in all colors and races and ethnicities there's no boundary to that but they are all over the place and sometimes they're in the most unusual of places so it's a beautiful life we get to create together and a beautiful vision we get to create together <laughs>